At the start finish line, stop sending out the trucks. Four helicopter in route, race mile three. Copy, no assessment of damage yet. Juan Lopez is down and he's on his side. Every race, we have emergencies. There's no getting around it. And I'm glad that I'm there to dispatch the help that's needed in the fastest possible time. So the whole course I've got plotted out. So when an accident happens at a specific mile, I know the closest medic to that and the closest checkpoint to that particular location. A weatherman has been around forever and ever and ever, um, but he was another one that didn't just take from the sport, he also gave back and part of his giving back was to go down there and set up relays and uh, communications to help the racers. Uh, we have a Royal Over Trophy truck, Rescue 3 is in route. I don't know if it was 75 or 76, I met Bill Strop, and Bill got me intrigued in off-road racing and I realized how terrible the communications were. So I had this bright idea, I put up a helium balloon and an antenna attached to the bottom and it went up 175 feet and I got the name Weatherman when Joe McPherson couldn't remember Bob and he's coming around the infield and he wanted a time split and he goes, uh, 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 weatherman. And it stuck from there. Forty years later, I'm still doing it. Weatherman is RPM pit. The weatherman, you know, he didn't do this for fame or glory. He just did it because the racers needed it. And he was always there to take care of the racers first. I don't know why we got so much stats. It's because there's a Richard Cranium out there with a stuck mic for the last 15 minutes. I came up with the phrase Richard Cranium because the other way to say it wouldn't go over the air very well with the FCC. Well, radio etiquette is very important when you have two, three, four, five, six thousand radios on a single channel. So the main thing is to get your message and so it's succinct and to the point using the six honest serving men. Who, where, how, what, why, and when. And uh, not talking over somebody just because you can. I ignore people for doing that. You just treat people like you want to be treated. In radio and in, in life, whatever. <laughs>